welcome back to another The Morris Plays Let's Play of Animal Crossing New Leaf on the 3DS. And we are in decoration mode or landscaping mode, whatever you want to call it. We have got still a bunch to do in town, uh, basically. We're pretty much, I would say, there with the pass. Hey, Sky running away from me why <laughs> the villagers just never they don't seem too bothered these days but we have laid lots of paths our fruit trees are growing it looks like we really need to pay off our public works project so we can start getting some new ones but we've got still bushes to lay plants to plant like flowers to plant whatever <laughs> cube hey we have to talk to cube we cannot ignore cube hey 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 maury it's the perfect weather for chilling outside seriously dude anyway did you need something? Let's talk. We're just chilling before we get into gardening mode, I'm sure. Hey, this is kind of sudden, but I want to head over to my house and hang out with me. I want to show you the sweet setup I have at home, dude. Okay, let's go. We cannot deny the adorable cube uh, a little request like that. So let's go. Um, but first, let's grab our shovel and just get this fossil real quick before we forget. Um... Just in case we don't come across it again later, or we forget. Uh, oh, there's another one here. <laughs> okay, we better fill in the holes. We don't want uh, anyone to fall in now. Come on, cube. Wait, you do live over here, don't you? Yes. This is your house, isn't it? Let's go. We're here. Just one more second, dude. Welcome, welcome. Good to see you. What? I just saw you outside, but yeah, I do love Cube's house. I love all the robo furniture. We have been in here before. I think Cube's just looking for some compliments. I'm not gonna lie. Let's put the TV on. I had no idea you could interact with the laptop. That's pretty cool. Nice. I love it when you can interact with things. Just, just mess up Cube's house. Can we turn the lava lamp off? Oh no. There we go. We are the king of the robo houses or something along those lines. Yes, we're very impressed, Cube. All that walking really tired me out, dude. Cube is just the sweetest. Okay, we haven't got time, Cube. We, we, we've got some things to do. Huh? Going home already, but we're having so much fun. Oh, I know. Can I ask you something before you go? What did you think of my house? Uh, we, I'm generally being genuine here. Uh, it's awesome, Cube. We can't hate on your house, and I do love the robo furniture. Really, I didn't expect you to like it that much, though. Is this what your house is like? Bye now, Maury. Next time, let's hang out at your place, dude. Okay, we're going to sweeten uh, Cube up by just doing the things he asks. Oh, he's coming out as well. Sky, hey. Hi there, Maury. Ready for another great day? So, what can I do for you? I want to chat. Lisa, Lisa was going, where have you been? It's been like 1,000 years. <laughs> Maury, have you ever heard of perfect fruit? I read in a book that it's totally different from other fruit because its flavor is so much better. Uh, I've been so curious to try it, but I can't seem to get my hands on any. If you find any perfect fruit, will you please let me try it? Uh, sure, there's literally some right over there. Really? Super, I can't wait. Okay, so we've got a little mission to do before we start then. Let's uh, let's find some perfect... Oh, hey! No way! I was not expecting to see Jack. What? Trick or treat! <laughs> uh, I am Mighty Sar of Halloween, Jack. Wait, what's with that look on your face? Are you perhaps wondering if today is Halloween, pumpkin? Fear not, this glorious and spooky night is not quite here yet. I came here today to look for loyal subjects who are willing to work for me all Halloween night. Hmm, you, you seem pretty sharp unless my pumpkin eyes are playing tricks on me. Wait, do you actually have eyes or are they just like holes? <laughs> when Halloween comes around on October 31st, would you like to be one of Jack's loyal subjects? Um, wait, are we supposed to accept this? Sure. I, don't, I can't remember how it plays out in New Leaf. Hehe, <laughs> well, it didn't take me long to find a servant. Let's get started with what you're supposed to do on the day of the festival, Pumpkin. On Halloween, you're supposed to scare everyone in town, scare them good and spooky. Your job is to find a costume that people in town are scared of and use that to scare them silly. And of course, when I talk about costumes, yes, I certainly mean some sort of mask. To celebrate you joining my ranks as a servant, 
<laughs> I'll give you one such item right now. Oh, cool. Can we wear it beforehand or do we have to I save it? Uh, take this ghost mask. Please collect as many of these scary items as you can, so you may spook people right away. You can buy them at Able Sisters Shop as well. The price is fixed at 1,031 bells. Very clever. Uh, so that should be your hint. Oh, and I do love October 31st, so, or 1031, pumpkin. And I'm going to tell you something vitally important. I love candy. During Halloween, everyone else will be asking for candy as well, so make sure you have enough to go around. Well, I, uh, was I clear enough in explaining your role? Yes, so we need to buy candy as well. I'm glad to have such a smart and eager servant. Right, please collect some spooky masks and candy by Halloween. The Halloween festival starts around 6pm on October 31st. Good luck with your preparations, pumpkin! Oh, and he's just vanished. What? <laughs> he, he, I'm counting on you. What, how can he talk when he's left? What is that? It's just creepy. Uh, okay, so I guess if Jack was here, we haven't got any visitors. It is Sunday, actually. So uh, Joan would have been here. Um, and, of course, we've missed her at this point. So we probably need to go to the shop, actually. Uh, let's see here. We've got a fossil we don't need to worry about. Uh, let's have a look at this mask real quick. Hey, scary mask. But we do want to save it. Uh, actually, do you know what? I'm glad to get those glasses off, those ladder shades. Um, we've been wearing them to way too long. Let's go and see. Opponent, we'll probably talk to you first, but then we're going to go to the shop and see if we can buy another mask, just in case. Hey, Maury, I've seen you around town, but we haven't talked in a while. Oh, we spoke too soon. Opponent, you're like the only D DLC village that hasn't left us yet. Can we talk? Apart from Inkwell, actually. Uh, you're really good at catching fish, aren't you, Maury? Well... How about ocean fish? Oh, what I wouldn't give to have one of those salty critters in my own. Saddle up. Can you please get one for me? Any kind will be fine. Uh, sure. Really, that's so nice of you. Okay, we'll worry about that later. <laughs> okay, Chester, hey! Well, if it isn't... Oh, Maury! I thought I'd come visit Moryland today. Good to see you. Oh, good to see you too. Let's go to Able Sisters first, and then we'll see if we can pick up some candy from somewhere. The mask is going to be in this side, isn't, isn't it? Uh, oh, welcome! Hello. So, what have we got? Oh, we have got a mask today. Is this the mummy mask? The mummy mask! That's a pretty good choice! This is a unisex item, so it can be worn regardless of gender. If you want to dress up as a mummy, I highly recommend wearing this accessory. It costs 1,031 bells. What would you like to do? I will... Let's let's have a look at it first. I mean, we're going to buy it anyway. Yeah, that's pretty cool, actually. Uh, a bit weird having the one eye there. Um, so that's quite creepy. I think that will be perfect. I think we should have as many masks as we can, just in case, like, they get used to... Like, if we have to talk to them multiple times, it might pay to have multiple masks. I don't think we want anything else from here, do we? What's this? Is that the Doctor's thing? Oh, this is a cool mask, but I think we've already got that, actually. And some aviators! Uh, yeah, okay, while we're here, we might as well check out what shirts they've got. Hey, Mabel! Welcome! Hey, we haven't been in here in ages, actually. Uh, nothing that really takes our fancy, I don't think. Uh, the rock and roll vibe of the leopard tee is nice, right? Yeah, I don't think that's our, uh, fashion, to be honest. No cost. I thought there might be some costumes in here, like the mummy outfit or something, but I guess not. In fact, do we- I can't remember, did we have a mummy outfit at some point? But, yeah, okay, we'll have to check back here daily, I think. Okay, well, thanks for your time, even though we didn't really buy anything and we're probably kind of wasting your time. Bye! <laughs> Thank you. Come back now. Okay, so where do we get candy from? Is it the TNT Emporium? Uh, welcome, welcome. Come on in. I'm hoping there's some candy. Where's the candy? Wait, do it. Where, where? Oh, there it is. It's right in front of me. Couldn't see it. It kind of blended in there. Ah, candy, a fine item. Yes, this is limited offer. That's only on sale this season, so don't let this opportunity pass you by. Uh, the price is 400, 400 bells expensive for candy. Are you interested in this item? I'll take it. Uh, thank you kindly for your purchase. Yes, thank you for your 400 bells, so shiny. Okay, I think that's, there's only one piece of candy here. Seems a little bit stingy. Toby, hey, hope you're not here to buy candy. Oh, Maury, I feel like I haven't heard your voice in ages and ages, Splatfest. 
The last time I talked to you was maybe a week ago. It was not, Toby. Come on. Uh, it's been a while, but I forgive you. After all, that's what friends do. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, while we're here, we might as well check out what's available. We're going to stay away from Gracie's items, I think. Just too expensive. We've got no money. Okay, nothing too exciting. Here you are. Oh, what's this? Oh, I thought it was a claw machine. Oh, yes! Yes, yes, yes! Ah, oh, spooky lamp, a fine item. Yes, this is a limited uh, time offer that's only on sale this season. So don't let this opportunity pass you by. Oh, we don't even have enough bells. Can we sell something here? We need to buy this lamp. Um, what can we sell? We might have to sell our gold nugget just so we can um, buy the lamp. Uh, yes, yes, of course. What would you like to sell? We're going to have to go with... Oh, why can't we sell a ladder chaise? Oh, that's right. We got them off Isabel, didn't we? They're a special item. That would be... Oh, wow. 3486 for a gold nugget. That's crazy. Let's buy this lamp. Not what I had planned today. We've gone off a bit, a bit of a tangent. Wasn't expecting to see Jack, but the guardian can wait. Um, a fine item. Yes, this is a limited time offer. Um, 4,124 bells. What is that? Does that signify anything? It seems a bit of a random number, uh, but we'll take it. Uh, thank you kindly for your purchase. Yes, thank you for the 4,129 bells. Wait, are there carpets in here as well? Checkered tile. No. I was kind of hoping for the spooky floor. Is there such item as a spooky floor? <gasps> spooky carpet! Yes, how much is this going to rob us? Oh, uh, why is everything what, uh, 4,100? What, what? I'm not getting the significance of that number. Maybe I'm being a bit silly. Okay, I don't think there's anything else. Is the wallpaper going to be here as well? No, floral wall. Okay, I'm guessing the carpet might be here on another day as well. Okay, I don't think there's anything else that we can sell that we can do without. Um, well, we could do the fossils, but... Hmm. That's a shame. We're going to have to come back. We'll get the carpet another day, I think. Well, thank you for, thank you for your time. We at least got the lamp. Okay, Toby, see you later. <laughs> uh, thank you for visiting. I'm pretty sure we haven't got any money in the bank either. Um, which sucks. Maybe before the next episode, we'll, uh, I'll go and do a bunch of bug hunting or something. Uh, what, why did you put that over there? Let's try and keep it tidy, please. Okay, so also, I think it would be good to leave all the spooky furniture, um, nearby and we can decorate it all at once. So we'll buy a piece every day, and then hopefully towards Halloween, then we can decorate a spooky room and have it for a week or so. Okay, where were we? We need to start moving some flowers around, I think. Actually, do you know what? We're going to leave the... Um, we're going to leave the masks up here as well. Oh, wait, where did the mask... Okay, what did I do with the other mask? Did I... Did I accidentally sell it? <gasps> oh no, what? The I'm so confused. I don't know what happened there. I'll have to look back on that. That's going to be interesting to look back at. I could have sworn I just dragged it to the uh, the ground. Or maybe I accidentally sold it. That would be really awkward. I'm so confused. Am I not paying attention here? I'm so sorry. <laughs> maybe I'm half asleep. I don't know what happened there. I was just kind of... I was on autopilot and then suddenly I didn't have the mask. I don't know. Maybe we didn't buy it. Okay, so we need to get back to moving some flowers around before we completely lose the plot. <laughs> um, so what are we going to do? We're going to make way for a bench here at some point. We'd really like to have a bench here. So I'm thinking if we can come up with... I suppose it depends on what bench we have. Um, so we can't really lay flowers there yet, can we? Um, we still owe a lot of money for the other public works project. Okay, I, re I really want to go and have a look at the mushrooms as well. So before we do anything else, let's go and double check our little forest. And see if we've got any new mushrooms here. No new mushrooms. Why are the mushrooms not growing? It's so weird. 
Okay. Another fossil. And let's start clearing up some of these flowers. Um, I don't know which ones we should use, though. Let's see what we have the most of. Tulips seem to be quite popular around here. These are my favourites, the violets. Pansies. We've got loads and loads of pansies. So, we're just doing a bit of tidying up, really. Nothing too crazy. I'm thinking... Have we got any other hybrids? See, this is a hybrid. Let's move some of the hybrids. We've only got one, though, it looks like. Yeah. That's a shame. Let's move some of these um, red and yellow... Uh, red and white ones, sorry. Down to where we want to have the bench, because I'm pretty sure we've, we probably will have a red bench, won't we? Now we've got a yellow bench up there. If not, I'm sure we'll make it work, but I just think it's nice to kind of put some flowers in, in here in preparation. And these are definitely the ones we've got the least of, so... But really, like... We're at the point now where we're just kind of bringing everything together, so... All that's left to do, apart from bringing Katrina into the main street, is of course decorating. We have been going since the 1st of January, so we're coming up to like 8 months. It's crazy. Uh, let's see here. So we want to make it so they will potentially spawn hybrids. This is not the best way to do it, but it, sh it might work. Get our watering can. I'm still so confused about what happened with that mask. I could have sworn I I know I accidentally put the uh, net down, but I thought we had it in our pockets. We're just watering these flowers and hopefully encourage them to maybe breed a little bit. I suppose uh, one task we could do that could take a long time is then start moving, trading out normal flowers for hybrids, but it does take so long. We don't seem to have too much luck with hybrids. Maybe I'm doing it wrong. I don't know. Okay, we've got a few hybrids here. We want to keep these tulips together. Uh, let's clean up any strays we've got. That's going to be a bamboo, so we're not too worried about that. These can go over here. We want to leave some space for the stump to potentially drop some uh, mushrooms. Oh, yay, a ping! I think my greeting... Oh, no. It's severely lacking in sparkle. Can you give me a, a peppier one? Uh, sure. Really, tell me what I should say. Um, let's say... What should we say? Let's just say flowers. Let's scream it. Fla oops. Flowers! Uh, what do you think? Perfect! I like to do the greetings and stuff based on kind of what we're doing at the time. Uh, it kind of helps us have an idea that way. Otherwise, I can never think of anything to do. Okay, should we get the balloon? Got another fossil here. It's also, what should we do with this space? Should we, oh, should we fill this in with flowers or? Never quite sure how many open areas we should kind of leave. What have we got here? More tulips. These can be tidied up. Yeah, it's going to be one of those episodes. Just moving a bunch of flowers around. Because it has to be done every now and then. See, they're all mismatched now. What's those dandelions can stay there. Roses need to go. These need to go. These need to go. They can go over here, though. Once all the flowers are in the correct places, then we can worry about... Um, setting them up to encourage hybrids. But I think for now, we'll just put them all in the right place. Otherwise, we're trying to do too much at once. Um, okay. 
We've got some more tulips. Oh, we've got roses here as well. Um, up here. We haven't got any more roses on us, have we? No. Okay, we like roses near our house. I probably, I would say, I don't really know what's my favorite ones. These are like my fav all time favorites, but sometimes the roses are really nice. Okay, we need to go and get rid of some tulips. They've just got too many. Okay, actually, do you know what? We're gonna have to use some tulips around this. Uh, let's decorate. So this is gonna be a, a big, uh, what's it? A big cube thing. So maybe we could just put some tulips around the edge of this, I think. Um, we'll move all the red ones here, I think. Got some more here. See, these, I really thought these were going to spawn some new ones, but they didn't. Oops. Okay, just a little bit of tidying. Um, is that all of them? Oh, is that another orange one? How long's that been there? I never know what how the easiest way to approach this is. Is it to do one lot of hybrids at a time, or do you just set them all up so they kind of just all grow? There we go. Didn't really want to spend too long moving the flowers around, but we've just got so many. They're all over the place. And we definitely seem to have more tulips than anything else. Roses in the wrong place. I blame a villager. Who is doing this? <laughs> um. There we go. So it's looking a little bit tidier. I think we put those, I think these ones we put here ourselves, didn't we, to sort out at a later date. Okay, so we need to get rid of some more tulips. Where can we put some more tulips? I'm thinking here. I'm thinking, is this Jeremiah's house? Yeah, Jeremiah, you can have some tulips. There we go. And we're gonna steal <laughs> steal these ones. Okay, we're getting oops, getting there. Jeremiah, hey! Oh, it's Maury. Hey there, Knee Deeps. What can I do for you? I just want to chat. Just check you're okay so we don't get accused of ignoring you. Hmm, I feel like hanging out, out inside, but I'm sick of my own place. Oh, I know. How about I come and hang at your house, Maury? Can I come over later? Sure, I might not be there, but... Sweet, then it's decided. So when should I come over? Anytime after half past five works. Okay. Right, at 5.30pm, right? That works for me. Just don't be mad if I'm a little late. Okay, as long as you're not mad if we uh, won't be there. <laughs> okay, we've got Cosmos all over the place here as well. Mm. Could probably 
probably sell a lot of these, actually. <gasps> Yay, another ping! Sky, give us some good news! So, uh, Mori, I need your honest opinion. You know how I say airmail a lot? Do you think I should find something else to say? Uh, no. I think it's great. Really? Okay, then I guess I'll keep saying airmail whenever I want to. Okay. Hopefully after today, we won't have to move any more flowers around for a long, long time. Because <laughs> it is a bit of a chore, isn't it? I think that's most of them, so let's just not worry too much about the flowers um, anymore. <laughs> he says as he picks more up. I can't help it. I just want them all in the right places. Okay. We should probably scour the beach. We need to make some money. Um... But definitely the best way to make money is, of course, go to the island to catch bugs. But I'll probably do that um, offline, I think. I can't believe it's been half an hour nearly already. That's a lot of time-moving flowers. <laughs> Which I do apologize for, but it kind of needs to be done, I think. But I promise we'll have some money to work with by the next episode. Because we'll do some... Uh, unless you want to watch uh, the bug catcher, maybe. We'll just go and sell these at retail. Double check what the... Uh, item of the day is. A Venus comb shell! I don't know if we, we would find any of those. would be pretty, pretty lucky if we did. Oh, oh I, do you know what? I always think this is the sloppy bed, but it never is. Oh, yes! Our little baby raptor! Um, yes, can I help you? I want to sell so we can pick up our raptor. Oh, we've got a few of them. Oh, we should just sell a bunch of flowers, shouldn't we, and start again. We've got too many! Uh, since I'm paying premium for at least one of these items today, the total is 1,605 bells. Okay, well, that's not that premium, but we'll take it. We appreciate it. And we'll take home our baby raptor. Yeah, a raptor model. Look at that. Thank you, Cyrus. That's so cool. I think we've got a T-Rex one and a raptor one now. Uh, wait. Oh, Jay, hey. There aren't a lot of items here, so uh, maybe the good stuff sold right away. Man, I should have come here sooner. Hey. Uh, thank you, come again. Yeah, so maybe we'll just sell the last remaining kind of stray flowers. There is a few here and there, like there's one over here we need to get rid of. The dandelions take care of themselves, um, so we're not too worried about those. But yeah, I guess that's all we can really do today is arrange the flowers. We'll consider the flower arranging done. We won't do any more. Uh, in the foreseeable future. We just wanted to kind of group them together and once a few projects start appearing we can start setting them up to grow hybrids but really it's just a case of keeping them in the uh, the places that we need for now to try and keep things tidy. So I hope you enjoyed this episode. It was really fun meeting Jack. If nothing else that was super fun and we did buy a spooky lamp so we're kind of working towards Halloween now which is really exciting so ignoring the flower bit and that kind of little bit of tedious work. I hope you enjoyed the episode. Thank you for watching. Thank you of course to channel members for making this happen and I hope you enjoy watching as we head towards Halloween. I'll see you in the next one. Bye!